The Yellowstone Caldera, also known as the Yellowstone Supervolcano, is an enormous volcanic depression, measuring approximately 50 kilometers by 70 kilometers, 30 miles by 45 miles, located in the western central area of Yellowstone National Park in northwestern Wyoming. The word caldera originates from the Spanish word for cauldron, and this deep crater covers a large proportion of the Yellowstone National Park. The Yellowstone caldera is over 640,000 years old and is the youngest of the three largest calderas in the park. Around 66 millions ago in the Cenozoic era, extensive volcanic activity, glaciation, and widespread mountain forming shaped the region. This included the formation of the Abasaroka Range along the current park's north and east sides. Around 16.5 million years ago, a period of intense volcanism began near the borders of present-day Nevada, Oregon, and Idaho, causing widespread volcanic eruptions, as the North American plate moved southwest over a shallow body of magma, a 500-mile trail of more than 100 calderas was created. Usually, calderas are formed after the collapse of the top of a volcanic cone, or group of cones, due to the partial emptying of magma chambers during large eruptions. Subsequently, there have been three more major eruptions in the Yellowstone area, two of which expelled more than 240 cubic miles of magma, a magnitude of 8, the highest ranking on the volcanic explosivity index. The earliest major eruption, the Huckleberry Ridge Tuff, occurred around 2.1 million years ago, and the Mesa Falls eruption approximately 800,000 years ago. The Lava Creek eruption led to the formation of the Yellowstone Caldera 640,000 years ago. These eruptions caused huge quantities of hot volcanic rocks to spread outwards. Hot ash, pumice and other rock fragments accumulated and stuck together to form thick sheets of hard rock. Volcanic debris from these eruptions covered most of the continental USA, with some material found as far away as Louisiana. Magma may lie just 3 to 8 miles beneath two resurgent domes inside the Yellowstone Caldera today, the Sour Creek Dome and the Mallard Lake Dome. Both domes are able to inflate and subside as magma volume and hydrothermal fluids shift between them. Over the past century, the caldera floor has tilted to the south due to net inflation, causing trees in Yellowstone Lake's southern shores to stand in water, and a sandy beach to form at the north end of the lake. The last volcanic activity at Yellowstone was approximately 70,000 years ago, when rhyolitic lava flows erupted. As a result of the largest flows, the Pitchstone Plateau in southwestern Yellowstone National Park was formed.